Hello students. Today we are going to learn division of numbers. Here we are going to divide a four digit number by a one digit number. We have learned this division in class 3. Still we are going to revise it once. Here the dividend is 2432 and the divisor is 7. We are going to see how many 7s are there in 2432. For that we have to say the table of 7. First we will see can we take any 7 from 2. It's not possible because 2 is smaller than 7. Now we can see the next number also. Now it has become 24. How many 7s are there in 24? 7 trees are 21. We have to say the table of 7 and we come to know that 7 trees are 21. 3 should be written just above 24 on top of 4. Now let's subtract it. 4 minus 1, 3. 2 minus 2, 0. Bring down the next number. Now the number is 33. How many 7s are there in 33? 7 fours are 28. Let's minus, turn it minus 8. 5, 2 minus 2, 0. We can either write 0 or we can put a cross here. Now bring down the next number. Now the number has become 52. How many 7s are there in 52? 7 7s are 49. That's minus 12 minus 9. 3, 4 minus 4, 0. We have got there are 347 7 are there in 2432. And the remainder is 3. Now we can say portion is 347 and remainder is 3. We have done our division. Now children we have learned the method of checking division. How can we check whether the answer is correct? For checking that we have to multiply the quotient with divisor plus remainder. First we have to multiply the quotient with divisor plus remainder. Let's do that. Then when you do that, if you are getting the answer 2432, it means your answer is correct. Let's see. Then we write the formula. Dividend is equal to quotient multiplied by divisor plus remainder. We will do the multiplication process first. 347 multiplied by 7 plus 3. Let's multiply and see. 347 multiplied by 7. 7 sevens are 49. 4 is remaining. 4 sevens are 28. 8 plus 4, 32. Again, 3 is remaining. 3 7s are 21. 21 plus 3, 24. 2429 plus 3. We got the number 2400. 32. Yes, we have got the same dividend as the answer. We multiplied and added the remainder. 
it means your answer is correct now let's do division by two digit number you can see the number here 2432 divided by 21 do you know the table of 21 we don't know the table of 21 so we cannot say the table and do the problem so what we are supposed to do we have to do the method of guessing okay let's do it let's see how to do it 2432 divided by 21 first we can see two numbers are the we can we need not see it only with one digit we have to see consider both the digits can we take 21 from 24 yes 24 is bigger than 21 then how many times we know the table of 1 and we know that when you multiply any number with 1 we are going to get the number itself as the answer then we can say 21 ones are 21 4 minus 1 3 2 minus 2 0 next step we can bring 3 down now the number is 33 now how many 21's are there in 33 we can guess the number by closing the last digit here and the last digit here we can see how many 2's are in 3 we know 2 1's are 2 then we can understand 21 1's are 21 3 minus 1 2 3 minus 2 1 bring down the next number we brought the next number now it is 122 now let's see how many 21's are there in 122 we can follow the same method of guessing by closing the last digit here and the last digit here. How many 2's are in 12? How many 2's are in 12? 6, 12, 6 2's are 12. We can multiply and see 21 where 6. 6 1's are 6, 6 2's are 12. 126. But do we have 126 here? We don't have, we have only 100. 22. Then it will not go 6 times, it will go only 5 times. 1 5s are 5, 2 5s are 10. Now 21 5s are 105. 12 minus 5, 7. 1 minus 0, 1. 1 minus 1, 0. We got the remainder as 17. Always remember, your remainder will be always less than the divisor. Okay? I hope everyone Let's do one more question. 4,617 divided by 32. Here also we don't know the table of 32. So we have to guess the number. 4,617 divided by 32. Let's see. In 46, how many 32's are there? 46 is bigger than 32. We can see how many 3's are in 4. 3 1's are 3. Then you can write 1 32's are 32. 6 minus 2 4. 4 minus 3 1. We can bring down the next number. 140. Now how many 32's are the in 141. We can say, use the same method of the same. 
Let's close the last digit here. Close the last digit here. How many threes are there in 14? Three fours are 12. Then let's multiply and see 32 by 4. Two fours are 8. Three fours are 12. We get, we have got already 128. 128 is less than 141. Then you can write 32 fours are 128. Let's minus 11 minus 8, 3, 3 minus 2, 1, 1 minus 1, 0. Let's bring down the next number. Now the number is 137. Let's see how many 32s are in 137. Let's close the last digit here. Last digit here. How many 3s are in 13? We have to see how many 3s are in 13. 3 4s are 12. And we have already multiplied 32 with 4. And we have got 128. 128 is less than 137. It means 32 4s are 128. 17 minus 8, 9. 2 minus 2, 0. 1 minus 1, 0. We got quotient. What is the quotient? 144. And remainder as 9. I hope all of you understood division by two digit numbers.